They can more or less feel it now, avoid defeat here, and they will take that eagerly awaited place in the knockout stage. The odds overwhelmingly in their favour. Everybody is expecting here, the crowd is up, they think the job is just about done. Indeed, in fact, it is. One more point does it, just one. Certainly, this is a very, very impressive venue. Quite a sight to behold. Morata has got himself a free kick. And it's Rodrigo. Plays it out to the wing. it over to the other flank and here's Kuchka Kuchka battles to win it back <laughs> that's surely a foul free kick yeah well they were exposed and, and vulnerable and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then Hemsik Well, talking about a captain taking control and, and casting his influence on the game, you really can't do it any better. It was a majestic finish to light up the opening to this contest. The tone's been set. More of the same, please. Dispatched expertly. Nicely done. Slovakia take the lead, landing the first significant blow in what is certainly a significant contest. That's the way you go about things if you want to qualify. It's superb. Can he deliver? No messing about, just bludgeoned away. Morata. Now it's Isco. It's out for a goal kick. Hamshik. Well, they are working very hard to get it wide now, Jim. Yeah, I think they've decided to concentrate on, on working the flanks to help the production line. It's, uh, it's where the room is. Saul gets it back. Saul brings the ball forward. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. The movement was good, but the pass lacked authority, uh, a cause of mild frustration. It'll be a throw-in. And it's played forward. And it's Saul. Isco. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. Kuchka, Kuchka goes looking. Not the worst cross in the world, but still room for improvement. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Forward it goes. And the assistant referee has his flag raised for offside. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Spain have it back and they can go again. And here's Isco. Up he goes! Cleared without complication. And here's Morata. Kuchka. Tries to get it forward quickly. 
Kuchka with a delicate ball. And they've been caught out here. Could try cutting inside here. Lovely bit of skill there. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. Kuchka. Hamšík. Kuchka. And here's Hamšík. He's making good use of his strength there, just refuses to be out-muscled. What an adventurous run from a defender. Well read, he sorted that out. Dubravka sends that a long way. And it's Hamšík. Played into space out wide. He's got away, plays it in, and he's certainly caught him there, it's a free kick. Keeper has beaten it away. Terrific save from the keeper. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes work ultra sharp. Good save. He got a decent fist on that. It has got through to him. Hoists it forward. If he's had a look, and he's thrown his whistle for half time. There we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. It's a dressing room that needs rousing at half-time because, in truth, they've not really been at it so far. Um, if the pep talk works, we may see a very different side second half. We need to. We're promptly into the second 45 minutes. Well, it seems like... The perfect situation for Fortune favouring the Brave. 45 minutes to pack in enough risk-taking to get this match turned around. It's very doable. Isco. Looking for a decent ball in. Hit into the middle. Spain get it back again. Goes for it! And that certainly packed a punch. Oh, that's a waste. Saul. And here's Rodrigo. Isco. Just needed a better contact. Morata really showed that he wanted it more than anyone else, but maybe heading requires extra practice. Thiago. Thiago plays it forward. A buccaneering run from the defender. Going through. And that has sent him sprawling. No question, that's a foul. Good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Your impression so far, Jim? Well, they may be down, but they're far from out. In terms of chances, they're right up there with these opponents. Now it's Rodrigo. Morata! Oh, it's gone in! Spain are all square. 
Stein are really pouncing on any stray passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. That has certainly made things interesting. Well, look, Peter, who knows what's about to happen from here. Uh, I doubt this will be the final score, though. Skriniar. Good challenge, he just stood firm. He's had that put on a plate. Has a hit! And the ball's come out. Morata. Out to the right. Pumps it into the area. And he's cut it out. Tries to get it forward quickly. And they can counter here. And it's Thiago. Isco. And it's Isco. Isco's cross. It's a bit of penetration to go with all this possession. Forward it goes. It has gone out. Ah, oh, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. Morata is being withdrawn here, but he certainly made his mark. Yeah, he'll get a good ovation for his contribution. I'm not so sure why he's leaving us, though. There's no obvious sign of, of injury or fatigue. Hamshik already, of course, on the score sheet. Who saw this coming? Spain have come back from the very brink. Hamšík, Slovakia showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. Keeper's got good distance on that. Throw in. Slovakia have turned to their bench, and we're going to have a substitution. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but. He couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. Almost nothing left on the clock here. Spain have their place in the knockout stage all but secure. Oh, that's neat. Well, both sides might have to settle for a draw here, although there's still a chance for one last fling. Ball's loose, who's getting there? That's a good ball, it's Alcacer! Oh, fine stop from the keeper. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Clear. Two minutes to be added on. Thiago. And that's that. Well, they could only manage a draw, but that will do. They have made it to the next stage. Thoughts on what we've just seen? It's certainly doing it the hard way, Peter, but the most important thing is that the team got the job done. Getting through is all that mattered, and whatever tests came their way, they showed they were more than capable of dealing with it, an experience that can benefit them all in the longer term. on their minds and that is to ensure that that coveted place in the knockout stages is theirs after 90 minutes they have the luxury of knowing it is in their own hands three points would be plenty to see them through however anything less than that and it could become precarious a look on the faces of the players nothing but utterly focused they know what they have to do 
I think we thought it's Lewandowski. He scored. Well, if that was their intention pre-match, let me tell you, it's worked out very nicely. I think for the skipper to chip in with a goal too is a bonus. But this game has already taken on a real attacking edge, and, and long may that continue. Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Poland have made their breakthrough, so can they build on it? Well, look, you've got to start your qualification process at some stage, Peter, and, and that goal is takeoff for them. Zielinski, Ektal gets it back. Looks to thread it through. Nick goes looking. Isak. Lewandowski gets into a dangerous position. Keeper sees it all the way. Sweden have opted to really stretch the game now. Yeah, that's pretty evident, but what's their thinking? Um, I, it looks as if the opposition are happy to defend the width of the 18-yard box, trying to remove that compactness. It's got through to him. Lewandowski. Just deflected behind for a corner. And he's there to clear it. Whipped in. Forsberg. He's got options out wide. Gidetti looks to drop one in. Oh, super tackle. They were outnumbered and under the cosh. That had to be spot on, and it was. And here's Lewandowski. Could be a chance here. Poor oh, robust challenge. Dashing forward at pace. Forsberg. Ektar. Victory now would mean so much. Kleisson. Poland scored early, of course, and the score is 1 0. Now it's Lewandowski. Lovely bit of skill there. It's a throw. Oh, well played, he needed to get that right. And that has been clubbed away. Frank Bist. Tries to get it forward quickly. Isaac really was well marshalled there because he was denied the opportunity to, to turn. It's a great ball. Forsberg hoists it forward. Forsberg hoists it high. Up to meet it! Good stop. That wasn't easy. John Gudetti sparked a tremendous stop there, and I think it's fair to add, he just wasn't expecting it. Out to the left it goes. Brzezinski, Lustig cuts it out. Lustig gets it away. Has he picked him out? Lewandowski going for goal! In it goes! Two up now, and they are cruising.
nothing. Pretty simple finish in the end. What do you think, Jim? It's almost criminal to see a defence fail to identify someone who thrives when it comes to shooting stats. They knew, and yet they didn't heed, and they paid the price and deserved to. He's made it two, and no doubt he's hungry for more. Poland take a two-goal lead, and things should be comfortable from here on in. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. And Poland now can counter. Uh, and that'll be the last act of the first half. See you on the first half. Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why dither from here when they can repeat their first half success with a, another show of strength? Poland in control at half time, 2 0. Well, the action has already resumed here. So both teams emerge the same as they were before the break. He's made sure that that won't get through. Gleison. And here's Gadetti. Floats one over. Forsberg. Gets up to hit it! Just off target. That's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried then. Click. And it's played forward. It's a brilliant interception. Yeah, managed to get it away. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, the idea was right. The delivery wasn't. They can revisit that further on. Zielinski, who does have an assist to his name. Brzezinski. Lovely bit of skill. Swung over. Great leap! Oh, just needed a better contact. Well, being able to generate that amount of activity in the box means it's hard not to pick someone out. Some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. <laughs> Ekdal. Poland in a very solid position, two to the good. Ekdal. Forward it goes. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Sweden have just about everyone back and central. Yeah, clearly they're trying to show strength to what the opposition have seen as a weakness. It's a safety foot. He's had a go! Done very well to get to that. Lewandowski really must have felt he had the measure of the keeper then, but how wrong he was. Tries to get it clear. Isaac. Battles to win it back. Krakowiak. And the counter is on. Krakowiak looking to get on the end of this. Kleisson. Kleisson plays it forward. Good challenge, he just stood firm.
Frank Fist. Kleisson. Ekdal. Isak. Isak! And the ball's come out. And the cutback. Shoots! And he's there to make a great save. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. Final checks on the touchline. A change about to occur. Well, you have to feel a little for the player been taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. And it's Lewandowski. Trout has a pop! And it's there! And they are cruising away. Time and space are plenty, he was never going to miss. Yeah, it looks simple, Peter, but it requires intelligent use of space and, and good understanding to pull it off. <laughs> Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. Fist. Lindelof. Frank Fist. Ektal. Ektal drives it forward. <laughs> Lewandowski is being picked on here. Yeah, his instinct and the timing of his runs have proven fruitful, but they have to give him a harder time like that. Now it's Lewandowski. Oh, he's in! Striding forward, facing goal. Lewandowski has a goal! He's kicked it out just. Lustig. Lustig. Ekta. Kleisson. Two minutes to be added on. And it's played forward. Added time is up, and there goes the whistle. Poland have booked their berth in the knockout stage. What a prospect for them. A job really well done so far. So four points from nine, it leaves them right on the cusp and sweating on the group equation. Thoughts on what we've just seen? Well, not as smooth as they would have preferred, but they're through, and that's the bit that matters most.